Sierra 3000, I believe vessel. So. It's the first time I've seen her. You don't believe it, but this is the front. She's got a big hole in the front. And she's almost square. <laughs> She must be a lot of fun to ride in the storm. All these windows there, that's the accommodation level for sure. And then there's the bridge and the alley pad. You could do with a paint job. She's got a giant heavy left crane on the back there. Big, big thing. There it is. It's actually on the back. Go back to the other end, take a look at it. There's a giant crane. It just goes up forever. It's actually two really big cranes. One's a lot bigger than the other. That's the owner. After you get aboard there, this little blue shack is security. Got to sign in, sign out, I guess. And the square nose. <laughs> There's the ROV station right there. There's that giant crane again. Boy, that's got to be heavy, huh? Sitting right on the back. This is a multi purpose vessel. If it was doing SLA pipeline, the pipe would come out right there. And somehow there'd be a a stinger like a sled for the pipe to go down into the water that's what those big shackles are for I guess or for lifting something look at the sides of those cables probably to hold the stinger because that's very heavy in itself but she looks like an old tub to me rusty and Bad shape. Not very welcoming. <laughs> Get this guy's load. I secured pretty good, isn't it? Good luck, dude. Okay, guys, that's it. I had to come down and take a look. You can see this crane for miles. Why that's a big one. Huh? One last look. And I'm out of here. I was supposed to go on this thing about two years ago. Maybe three years ago. I don't think I missed much. I can't remember what happened, why I didn't go, but I didn't make it anyway. <laughs>